Hey guys, it's John, and welcome back to Undertale. Last time we left off at the spaghetti, and uh, let's continue going. Warning. Dog marriage. Hmm. Mess with these rocks now. Oh, lesser dog appears. Act, lesser dog, pet. You barely lifted your hand and the lesser dog got excited. Pat, pat. Let's just do it. Oh. Lesser dog is barking exceedingly. I'm gonna pet it again. You lightly touch the dog. It's already overjoyed. Lesser dog is barking excitedly. You pet the dog and raise its head up and meet your hand. You pet the dog, it was a good dog. Unless your dog is overexcited. You pet the dog, its excitement knows no bounds. Excited noises. Oh, I didn't expect that. Lesser dog is over -tumulated. Critical pit. Dog excitement increased. Excited noises. You won. You earned a zero EXP and seven gold. Good thing I could spare it, right? <laughs> Should I walk on the snow? Oh, so it's one of these rocks. No? There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. And it was not one of the rocks. It was that solid path. This battle took way longer than it should have, so I'm just going to speed it up. dogs I think what's that smell where is that smell if you're a smell identify yourself are they blind hmm here's that weird smell it makes me want to eliminate you okay I don't want to kill these guys dogs smell roll around you roll around in the dirt and snow you smell like a weird puppy okay re-sniff the dogs sniff you again after rolling in the dirt you smell all right That actually worked. Dogs think you might be a lost puppy. Pet. You pet dogs, ma. Wow. Pet by another pup. Dogs think you might be a lost puppy. You pet dogs, ma. There we go, we spared him. Dogs can put other dogs. A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. What's this? Some kind of puzzle? Turn every X into circle, then press the switch. There we go. What? 
How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Ate it. I just kind of left it there. Really? Wowie. No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then. Fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> Papyrus. Just gonna let me pass you? My... <laughs> My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy think taking care of him. <laughs> Human. Hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I'm saying is, worry not, human. I, the great Papyrus, will solve this con... conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Oh, so I gotta go in here and turn every circle, I mean every X into a circle. This puzzle took me way longer than it should have, so I'm just gonna speed it up too many tries. No, I walked backwards! There we go. See, wow, you solved it. And you did it without my help. Incredible, I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love this next puzzle then. It might be even too easy for you. <laughs> oh, it's Sans. Good job on solving it so quickly. It actually took me a few tries. You didn't even need help, my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Alright, thanks, Sans. Oh. Hey! It's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles. Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are the alarm tiles. If you step on them, you have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through them if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile, like ice! However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Understand? I understand completely. Of course. Great. Then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been solved before. Not even I will know the solution. Nehehehe. <laughs> Get ready. Oh. Oh. What? Okay. Can I just cross it? Yeah. 
Actually, that spaghetti from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking, lessons have been pretty improving a lot. I bet he keeps it up. Next year, he'll even make something edible. I'd say the spaghetti was probably pretty edible. What's this? The machine isn't working. Well, no dip. Oh. Cats, dogs, heads. Oof. I'm gonna see. Knowing that the dog will never give up trying to make a perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. On the floor inside is a box of Prama raisins. It's a goat man. A dog just rushed in here filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. But as it built it, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. The snack got longer and longer and added more and more snow until... It was rather sad to watch, but I couldn't turn away. Oh. Long neck, huh? Okay. Oh, well, it's ice. I didn't know it was ice. Well, I knew part of it was ice. It's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sands written on it in red marker. <laughs> Oh, you can just fall off the edge? Oh, crap. No, just fall off. Bottom root. Then how do I get there? Like that. Whoops. Man, this is difficult. Ah, I think I got it this time. And it made a bridge. Nice. Can't even see. I'm gonna go down here. Oh, it's sands. What's up? Eyes. Well, these things have a lot of health. Oops. There you go. Say, are you following me? Can you get both of them on the screen at the same time? Nope, physically impossible. Some kind of cave? It's a door. Well, that's that then, huh? Don't have the key for this uh, alleged door. What a tiny doghouse. Another bite, maybe greater dog? No, a nice little cute dog. Oh, how cute. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! It's the greater dog. Beckon, play. Play? Greater dog is not excited enough to play with. 
Oh. Ignore. Reader dog inches closer. Reader dog is not excited enough to play with. Darn. Greater dog inches closer. Oh. I just thought they were always blue. Greater dog inches closer. Oof. Greater dog decides you were too boring. You won in order 40 gold. Hey, I did it. Long bridge. Human, this is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. Oh. Oh. What is that? Is that a dog? Just floating there. When I say the world, when I say the word, sorry, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Do it. Do it. Oh, what's the hold up? Hold up. What hold up? I'm about to activate it now. I wonder what the dog's gonna do. That uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems, may be too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are especially cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. I think the dog has class. Away it goes. Phew! What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Nah. Ha. Yeah. Ha. Yeah. Alright. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I'd make sure I understand blue attacks. I do. Welcome to Snowden. Nice little town, huh? The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. I'm going to the shop. Hello, traveler. How can I help you? Hello. Hiya, welcome to Snowden. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? So many questions. Can I sell stuff? Sell something? Does it look like that's a pawn shop? I don't know how it works where you came from, but... If I started spending money on old branches and used bandages, I'd be out of business in a jiffy. Buy tough glove manly banana... <laughs> banana? Manly banana! It's bandana. Cinnamon bun. Hmm. You know, I'm gonna buy one of these. Bye bye now. Come again sometime. Use this box. Yes. Oh, there's nothing in there. This is an inn. Welcome to the Snowden Inn. Snowden's premier hotel. One night is ADG. I'll stay. Here's your room key. Make sure to bundle up. Oh. Hiya. You look like you had a great sleep. 
which is incredible because you were only up there for two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me when you go in to stay overnight. Okay. Oh! I just missed everything. Was the library spelled wrong? Hmm. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. This one? Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. Tee hee. Awful teens are tormented by a local monster by decorating the tree like horns. So we started giving monster presents to make them feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath the decorated tree, just like Christmas. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Oh, those kids just wear striped shirts now? This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there ever is a problem, the skeleton will tell you... Will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. Okay, that's, uh... Pretty odd. Hey, it's... A bunch of the people I defeated. Or, spared. Okay, sit down. No. Talk to Groovy. Groovy said he, that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. Because <laughs> he's fired. Bet he can't even go outside. Up we go. Ah, to be young again. The world sure felt boundless. Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, my patience rewards me. Ah. 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 <laughs> What's this? Let's play Monsters and Humans. You aren't gonna make me the human again, are you? Oh. That's spelled wrong. I don't need new books, but I could go inside. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. Haha, <laughs> I do it. Oh man. I wonder whose little mailbox this is. It's a mailbox overfilling with unread junk mail. <laughs> it's a Sands and Papyrus' house. It's locked. Oh. It's in the shit. It's locked from the inside. Hmm. Papyrus. Human, allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover. The admiration for another's puzzle-solving skills. The desire to have a school smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. <laughs> I can hardly imagine what I must be feeling. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the Great Papyrus, will be your... No, no, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. 
You are human. I must capture you. Then, I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus. The newest member of the Royal Guard. Man, I thought for a second we were gonna be friends there. Papyrus blocks away. Insult? Insult. How selfless. You want me to feel better about fighting you? <laughs> I don't su deserve such hospitality from you. But I insulted you. Okay. Papyrus is trying hard to play it cool. What? For flirting Do you finally reveal your ultimate feeling? I insulted you! I'm a skeleton with very high standards. I have zero redeeming qualities. I can make spaghetti. Oh no, you're meeting all my standards. I guess that means I have to go on a date with you. A state leader. After I capture you. That was... Uh, Papyrus is thinking about what to wear to his date. Insult. There's no need to lie to yourself. Your barbs had an affection. Oh, this is really simple. Papyrus is thinking what to cook for his date. Okay. Insult. Don't. Don't waste your words on me. Papyrus dabs some bone cologne behind his ear. Bone cologne. Your insult, but to no avail seems that acting won't escalate the battle. Don't waste your words on me. This is doing nothing. See you won't fight? Then let's see if you can handle a fabled blue attack. Okay. I didn't know I turned into blue heart. You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> Insults. Papyrus is too busy fighting you to accept your insult. At least the fight escalated. He dabs some MTT brand anime powder behind his ear. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. I'm getting the hang of this. Ha, ah, don't make me use my special attack. Darn out. I can almost taste the future popularity. Popularity. I didn't expect that bone. Pyrus, head of the Royal Guard. But Pyrus realizes he doesn't have ears. Don't expect those. Undyne will also be really proud of me. Just keep telling you this, self that, buddy. Darn, these things. The king will trim a hedge in the shade of my smile. Do is jump straight up, dude. Papyrus is preparing a bone attack. Okay, maybe I should, uh, eat an ice cream. Papyrus is cackling.
I like this, kind of like Flappy Bird. Papyrus is trying hard to play cool. Some like you is really rare. And dating might be kind of hard. Oh, that's right, don't move in the blue ones. Last bone. Nope. Papyrus new whispers. Nehehehe. <laughs> After you're captured and sent away. Darn. I don't like the blue heart thing. Ah, who cares? Give up. I can't really run away. Darn, I'm hitting everything, huh? Ah, uh, you get one half of the bicycle you rode. Covered 11 HP. Oh no, your special attack. Aha, very soon I will use my special attack. What's your special attack gonna be? Papyrus is considering his options. Not too long and I'll use that special attack. Yes, we know you all have one. Spider Cider. You drink the Spider Cider. Recover 24 HP. It's your last chance before my special attack. Behold, my special attack. Oh. What the heck? That's my special attack? Hey, you stupid dog. Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone. Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack. Oh well. I'll just use this really cool regular attack. <laughs> use my normal attack. I gotta admit, that was cool. Oh no, it's not over yet. Tiny bone. Oh, it's distracting me, probably. I'm ready. Well, Huff, it's clear that you can't defeat me. I can see that shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the great Papyrus, elect the great you pity. I will spare you, human. Now, here's your chance to accept my mercy. Just slaps him in the face. No, ho, ho. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. And I'm going to be so disappointed to me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend quantity will remain spaghetti. What do you say? Let's be friends? What a loser. I want to be your friend. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess, I guess I can make an allowance for you. Well, we, we haven't even had our first date. Is this what you think friends are? Dating objects? And I've already managed to hit the friend zone. <laughs> Who knew that I would need to make pals? Was it to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you the permission to pass through. And I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, Cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all in the underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit, except someone with a powerful soul. Like you. 
That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with the soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. Is that Asgore? He is, well, a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer. <laughs> Can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come back and have a date. <laughs> what? What? Okay. That was weird. Well, all right, guys, I think we're going to end it there. Thank you, guys, and have a great day.